Unraveling the mystery. I don't have a clue. Hello, wonderful learners. Today, we're diving into a common English phrase that you might have heard in conversations, movies, or books. I don't have a clue. This phrase is a gem in everyday English language, and understanding it can help you navigate through both casual and formal conversations. So, let's explore what it means, when to use it, and how it can enhance your English communication skills. At its core, I don't have a clue, signifies a lack of knowledge, information, or understanding about something. It's a straightforward way to express that you are unsure or do not know the answer to a question or the solution to a problem. But don't let its simplicity fool you. This phrase is incredibly versatile and can be used in various contexts. This phrase can be employed in numerous situations, ranging from casual conversations to more formal discussions. Here are a few scenarios to help you understand its usage. 1. In response to a question, when someone asks you something you don't know the answer to, saying, I don't have a clue, is a polite and clear way to communicate your lack of knowledge. 2. As an expression of confusion, if you're discussing a topic or situation that is complex and difficult to understand, this phrase can convey your confusion effectively. 3. To emphasize a lack of involvement. It can also be used to assert that you have no information or association with a particular event or situation. While, I don't have a clue, is a popular phrase, there are several other expressions that carry a similar meaning. Familiarizing yourself with these can enrich your vocabulary and allow you to express yourself more precisely. Some of these variations include, I have no idea, I'm clueless. It beats me. I'm in the dark. Each of these phrases can be used interchangeably, depending on the context and your personal preference. To help you better understand how to use, I don't have a clue in real life conversations. Let's look at a few examples. One, where did you put the remote? I don't have a clue. I haven't seen it. Two, do you know why the meeting was canceled? I don't have a clue. Maybe we should ask our manager. 3. How do these two systems integrate? I don't have a clue. We might need to consult the tech team. Understanding and using the phrase, I don't have a clue, can significantly aid in your English language journey, making your conversations more natural and expressive. Whether you're a beginner or looking to polish your English, Incorporating phrases like this into your vocabulary can enhance your fluency and confidence. We hope this video has shed light on this commonly used phrase and that you feel more comfortable using it in your daily interactions. Happy learning, and remember, it's okay not to have a clue sometimes, it's a natural part of the learning process.